to back in Cape Town, all messages on Twitter. All out to watch One Man Tonight, and that's the great Oscar Pistorius. Keep your tweets coming, at Paralympic is uh, our address. Nana Soft from Cape Town tweeted to say, great commentary from the athletics commentary team. So informative and entertaining. That must be you they're talking about there, Chris. Oh, no, no. I think you're running the show here. No, no. I'm entertaining. You're informative. Why, <laughs> thank you. Uh, keep your comments coming. At Paralympic. Belinka Goldridge says, wow, all these athletes are incredible. Such an inspiration to watch. Well done to each and every one of them. You see, you can't take your eyes off the action for a moment. I look at the Twitter feed and instantly there's another right, another final happening here. So we saw Curtis Tom from Canada in lane one, Kenny Van, we Van Wagel from the Netherlands in two. This is the current world record holder, Leo Pekka Takti. -ta 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 went 13.63 in qualifying. Now we have uh, Saichon Konjen from Thailand. 29 years of age. So, who do we think is the one to watch then in this? The, the, the Finnish guy? I think you got to watch the Finnish guy, yeah. Tati. The guy to watch, but there are a lot of guys. Kenny Van Wagel's a, a guy who's been around for a long time who I think is looking to go looking to go fast too. The Kui here. Two Chinese competitors. China. You can uh, never rule them out in, uh, in big game competition. There's the German, Mark Shu. And... Uh, Another Thai competitor in the outside lane, Super Chai Kruisup. That's a great name for an athlete, isn't it? Super Chai? Super Chai, yeah, exactly. It's a great name. Chai means tea, doesn't it? So I like a cup of tea. Super tea. And this one's going to be over pretty quickly. So here we go. It's uh, the athlete in lane four, Tati of uh, Finland. Season's best of 13, 6 3, the one to look out for. Here we go. Men's 100 meters, T54 final, and wow. the Finnish competitor's away, and he's being pursued by the Chinese competitor, Yang, in lane six, but uh, the Finn's gonna get to the finish. It's gonna be a big one for Tati there. Is it gonna be a good time? 13.78, just outside the Paralympic and world record, but a great run for Leo Pekki Tati of Finland, 29 years of age, and he's absolutely delighted with that. Li Yang of China, I think, got the silver. I couldn't see who got the bronze, but uh, Leo Pekatati of Finland winning the men's 100 meters T54. You can see just how quickly he got out of the got out of the start, got out of the hole. We call it getting out of the hole because literally it feels like you're pushing out of a hole when you're trying to get out of the start. And he got out so quickly, put space in between himself, put daylight in between himself and the rest of the field right there out of the start. And it was just a matter of holding on and trying to see if anybody could come back on him and nobody could come back on him. And it almost looks like there's so much power in those shoulders that one of his hardest things is to keep that front wheel down because you can see the wheel keep, com keep coming up. It's a huge thing because, because on the follow through you're pushing and then you've got the follow through right there where the front end is coming up because all of your weight, all of your arms, all your force is going backwards and going up. You can see how his head was was as low as it could possibly be working as a counterbalance. So there's confirmation that Tati of Finland, 1379, takes the gold. Li Yang of China takes the silver. And Seishon Konjen of Thailand, it was, who came through to get the bronze medal. Confirmation of uh, all the times there. And you can see the wind speed as well. 